Hi everybody. Thanks for coming to see me today. My name is Chelsea and I'm the Director of Education at the Unitarian Church in Lincoln, Nebraska. And today I'm going to continue with a series I've been doing on uh, mindfulness for children. And um, today our, we're going to continue with the theme of uh, loving kindness. So I have a story for you and it's called Heart Prints. And it goes like this. How many heart prints will you leave today? Will you share with a friend? Will you give hugs away? Will you listen with patience to what others say? How many heart prints will you leave today? A heart print is formed when you do something kind. Your love touches others, leaving heart prints behind. You can smile at people you pass on the street. You can offer a handshake to someone you meet. You can even pitch in for an hour or two to help out a friend with too much to do. Sometimes you'll reach out to someone in strife and do something thoughtful that changes a life. Or sometimes you may say the quietest thing and never quite know how you made a heart sing. Yes, each little kindness leaves heart prints that say, a very nice person has been here today. So will you cheer up a playmate in need of a smile? Will you tend to a friend who's been mending a while? This much is certain, whatever we do, the heart prints we give out make us happy too. So offer your friendship to each girl and boy, then join in the music, the singing, the joy. You can brighten the world as you go on your way. How many heart prints will you leave today? And that's the end of the story. So I'd like for you to think about some of these questions within your own family. What are some kind things your family or friends have done for you? What are some acts of kindness that you've done for friends and family? And what are some kind things that you might like to try and do between now and maybe when you see my next video or in the next week or so? Well, thinking about kindness, I'd like for us to do another meditation where we're thinking about the kindness that we have for ourselves and the kindness that we have for our family and friends and for the whole world. Again, this kind of meditation uh, is also called meta meditation. So I'm going to walk you through it. And last week we did meta meditation with uh, stuffed animals. So if you'd like to do that again, you're sure will welcome to. You can grab a stuffed animal and hold it close to your chest as you read the meditation. And if it's easier for you to focus, if you just have your hands free and don't have anything in your hands, then that's fine too. But settle in, make yourself comfortable. Whether that's lying down or finding a nice seated position. And we'll get started. I'm going to ring my bell again, and as the bell's ringing, that's your time to kind of get settled and take a deep breath and be ready for the meditation, okay? Take another deep breath. Focus your attention on your body and smile as big as you can. 
feel your heart get bigger as you smile. Imagine yourself surrounded by beautiful golden light and say, just in your own mind, may I be happy. May I be really happy from my head right down to my toes. Then say, I love myself dearly. Breathe. Now imagine all your family, your parents, maybe you have brothers and sisters, grandparents, uncles, aunts, cousins, and pets. And just in your mind, see them standing in front of you smiling, surrounded by beautiful golden light. And just in your mind, think these words. May my family be happy. May they be really happy from their heads right down to their toes. And then say, I love my family dearly. And breathe. Now think of your friends, teachers, your neighbors. Imagine them standing in front of you, smiling, surrounded by beautiful golden light and say, may my friends, teachers and neighbors be happy. May they be really happy from their heads right down to their toes. And then say, I love my friends, teachers and neighbors dearly. And breathe. Next, bring your focus back to yourself and see the golden light that surrounds you spreading out to all the people and animals in the world. Imagine the earth surrounded by a beautiful golden light and think to yourself, may all beings be happy. May they be really happy from their heads right down to their toes. And then think, I love all beings and accept love from all of them too. And breathe. Now slowly wiggle your toes and your fingers and open your eyes. And I'm going to ring our bell again. So I'd like for you to try and keep all that love and all that kindness in your heart, even when we're not together, when you're not watching this video, okay? Keep it with you throughout your days. And at night, last time, you know, I'll repeat again that if you're scared or anxious or if you're having a hard day, these are always really good things that you can practice to help you calm down and feel happy again, all right? So I hope that you have a wonderful week and thank you for joining me. Bye.